My name is Sam Zimmerman. Uh, I'm the CTO and co-founder of Freebird. Uh, earlier today, Ethan gave uh, a, a pitch for our launch competition, introducing Freebird where it stands now. Last year, this time, we were just closing our round. Uh, we raised three and a half million dollars from several well-known investors, including General Catalyst. And we were simply a rebooking tool. So we enabled travelers to instantly rebook their tickets at no additional cost when their flight was canceled or they missed their connection or th there was a severe delay. Now, that is still absolutely core to who we are. But we discovered kind of over the course of the year two things. The first was that the corporate travel market had a great need for something to enable travel agents to better take care of their passengers, uh, to enable corporations to, to have their salespeople um, you know, not miss that important meeting. Um, and so over the past year, one major thing we've discovered, uh, something we thought all along, but I think we really had validated, was that, um, um, that there was a real need in the corporate travel space uh, for a technology solution that would, uh, that would help passengers in times of disruption. I think the second major shift for us um, is discovering that we're data nerds. Um, uh, the TQ, as Ethan talked about, um, uh, really is uh, taking a, a lot of diverse data sets um, and a lot of really talented uh, data scientists and data engineers and structuring that information uh, in such a way to power our booking tool, um, as well as to power other analytic uh, um, things like our TQ data feed. Um, so first, tell me what TQ is for the, for the viewers. So TQ, uh, Travel Intelligence, short for TQ, like IQ or EQ, uh, um, is the cutting edge data science and predictive analytics we're using on flight disruption data, on weather data, and flight pricing data um, uh, to produce simple tools like uh, to price our booking solution, um, as well as to inform, uh, 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 as well as to inform uh, companies about about the risks, the aggregate uh, and micro risks that their travelers are taking every day. So tell me what the business product is. You described a need that you discovered, but is that delivered in a product, or how is it delivered? Uh, it is. Um, so, for example, our rebooking tool. If a company comes to us and would like Freebird, the risk of a flight being disrupted varies across a number of different factors. The time of year, the carrier, the time of day, as well as what the weather is likely to be. And so in order to accurately price Freebird for that company, we need to understand kind of all of those factors and ultimately price it in such a way that it makes sense for the company and it makes sense for Freebird. So it's like an intelligence product that defines what level of insurance they go to? Yep. And do you pitch that as a white label or does that come with the product? How does it work? That comes with the product. So we announced a deal with Flight Center and Casto, both of which support uh, co-branded flows. So our rebooking tool works via a text. So you get a text, you click that link, go to our Freebird rebooking flow. That flow will have both Flight Centers and our logos, enabling the traveler to associate Freebird with the tool and understand that Flight Center is providing it. So a year ago at Focus Right, I met Ethan, he wasn't presenting. I downloaded an app, but I think I heard him today say on stage, that there is no app anymore. Yep. So because we're a travel agent's best friend, we are medium agnostic. So we want to provide simple tools to help a large class of travelers solve their own problems and then allow travel agents to do what they do best, uh, which is take care of those really ugly, gnarly edge cases and produce really good outcomes for the traveler. So is it a B2C pro product or a B2B or which way is it going? It's B2B. Um, so we, uh, we can send a disruption message via an SMS or via an email or via your own app. Um, so we, we're, we're a B to B to C or a B to B uh, company. Okay, so you started B to C, you've pivoted effectively, you're now distributing through agents and corporate agents. Uh, yep, I think that I would say that uh, we viewed that time of kind of B to C as instrumental for building and understanding our product. Um, it wasn't so much that it was a pivot as much as if it was a kind of incubation period where we're able to uh, uh, develop our technology, to develop our, our definition of what a misconnection is, um, our, our messaging, um, so that uh, when we work with these really large, really high touch clients, that we're able to provide this, the level of service and quality um, that, they, that, that, that they get by by providing to their, their companies. So I have the app on my phone, it doesn't work anymore, so I need to now go back to my travel agent and tell them to start working with you guys. Yep, exactly. Excellent. Well, we wish you the best of luck. Thank you. Thank you.